close video Bob Saget's friends comedian Jeff Ross and musician John Mayer live-streamed their emotional journey bringing the late comedian's car back home from the airport. The duo were good friends with Saget and were among the first to speak out about his death. As a result, they volunteered to retrieve his car after he drove it to LAX to catch a flight to Florida where he performed in a comedy show the night he died unexpectedly in his hotel room. While making the trip back to Saget's home on the 405 freeway, Ross took to Instagram from Mayer's account and worked the camera while the singer drove. The conversation got emotional at times as they both reflected on their friend, with Ross quickly cracking a joke every time it seemed like Mayer was about to cry behind the wheel. The singer opened by stating how difficult it is to talk about what Saget meant to him given the knowledge that he was beloved by and made an impact on so many others. Everyone is so aware how universal Bob's love for people was that nobody wants to step on anyone else's toes, he explained. And the fear for me is that everyone, out of respect, demurs and defers and that's just because people understand how important their personal relationship with Bob was. The biggest fear would be talking about the love of Bob in a way that would supersede someone else's love of Bob. Ross added, he really was love. He represented that. He has a beautiful wife, three daughters and then made his fake family from TV and it was a real family. Ross was referencing Saget's co-stars on Full House who he remained close with even after the show ended, often referring to each of them as his family. Almost every single cast member issued a statement following his death to honor and eulogize the man who is being called America's dad. Mayer noted that the biggest lesson he learned from Saget was to tell the people in his life that he loved them as often as possible because he saw how much it helped Bob's loved ones in the wake of his passing. Everyone can go, he loved you. He said this and that and that about you, the singer explained. Bob's effusive and repeated expression of love is the greatest gift that he left people because all we have is the pain of his going and we don't have to worry about the accounting. The affairs are in order in terms of wondering, or not having to wonder, how Bob felt about us. He joked, this is the only time in my life I've been honored to help a friend out at LAX. Both men got emotional when they realized that the person they would each have called to help them process this kind of unexpected grief and loss was Saget. Mayer lamented that he would have found a nuanced way to explain the situation and Ross noted that Saget had a way of looking on the bright side of things. Bob really did take care about everybody. If you need a doctor, if you need a lawyer, if you need a pastrami sandwich at 3 in the morning because some girl just broke your heart, Bob was that guy, Ross explained the comedian commended his friend for his positivity in light of the tragedies he saw throughout his life, including the death of family members like his two sisters. He had an excuse not to be positive. Bob had every excuse under the sun to be cynical, to be upset, to be distrusting of fate. He had every reason under the sun not to trust the system, Mayer said through tears. Mayer continued, he laughed and he spread joy in his protest against the cruelty of these things was that he was going to smile, and spread love, and be childlike, and be innocent, and be loving. The duo concluded the Instagram Live while they were still on the drive in order to have a few moments to themselves before bringing the actor's Toyota Prius back to his wife, Kelly Rizzo.
Rizzo took to her Instagram story later that evening to share what the live stream meant to her to watch. These two men have been holding me up and taking care of me, along with many other incredible people who loved my husband more than anything underscore but these two, driving our little Prius that Bob left at the airport, home, was such a solid. And I'm happy it gave them some time to ruminate and share their love of Bob with all who watched. The Prius is now home, she wrote.